long time ago, there was a mysterious book known to a select few as the Legendary Opuses. From the numerous classics written inside, this mysterious book made amassing the power of music possible. Was it mere will or simply destiny? Before long, the book was entrusted into the capable hands of the sextant. Six renowned conductors. With the book in their hands, various classics were performed at each of their six concerts. When the final concert came to a close, it is believed that through the magic of the music, a tiny fairy was brought to life. The fairy named Symphony was admired by the people as a musical spirit. And over the years, she continued to protect the concert halls built in the city, as well as the town itself. Young man, you of rare talent and a destiny to match, please lend an ear to our quest. Once long ago, an ancient book graced this town. For many long years, spanning the ages, this book was handed down by numerous musicians. Before anyone knew it, the book was dubbed the Legendary Opuses, and it made its way to us. Our sextet conducted concerts at different places, using the musical compositions inscribed in the book, thus connecting the hearts of all music lovers that gathered there. Of miraculous wonder. Something only worthy of being stored up in the legendary opuses was created from some mysterious meteor of our experiences. The hearts of music lovers, as well as the gusto of music. Indeed, you know the pixie too. We named her Symphony. And since then, she has been the patron of this town, protecting concert halls as a musical spirit. Hmm. But a deplorable situation arose. The ears rolled by, and before anyone knew it, the existence of the legendary opuses was forgotten completely by the people. Now, the power of music stored up in the legendary opuses is dwindling away. Before long, the musical compositions and concert records will also diminuendo to fini, the end. We aim to grant this power to someone once again, thus reviving the legendary opuses and once more awakening the Elon of music. In order for you to better hear our request, we're speaking to you in this magical dream state. If things continue, not only will the existence of the legendary opuses be lost, but along with it, the joie de vivre of music itself will surely be out of sight and out of mind forever from our town. And with it, Symphony too. So, youngster, please accept this book. Could you trace the path of the concerts we held in the past and restore the musical power that is disappearing from this book for us? We haven't much time left before the hearts of music lovers fade forever. Please hear our request and awake! Awake! Having the 
book as well as us meeting again like this makes me think that Destiny played a hand in this. With you being the orchestra conductor of this place and all, it is hardly a coincidence that this book was given to you. Don't sweat it, Tack. The compositions are still inside the beginning of the book. Let's start by practicing this tune and then master it. After that, you can conduct your own concerts in the place where the Sextant held their show so many years ago. Now, while the power in the music still remains, is the time. If you can amass the energy of music from the people at your concert, you can surely restore the magic of the legendary opuses. Seize the moment you can bring the last pages back to life. So come on, do it for me. Please revive the legendary opuses by storing up its musical power one more time. Welcome to the realm of Bravo Music! Bravo Music is a musical action game where you are the conductor who creates wonderful music with the Bravo's orchestra. Huh? You say you're not sure of yourself since you've never conducted before? Don't worry! You can brush up on your conducting skills with the Bravos in this music room. So let's get practicing. You can't create wonderful music if the conductor is not on the ball. Let's start with the basic of basics. Directing the tempo of the music is the first step. If you can do that, move on to the next step. Don't sweat it! You can do it! Oh, by the way, it's a good idea to turn the volume on your TV up. Why, you ask? To increase the intensity of the performance and your own emotional intensity. Let's do it! So which one shall we pick? Controlling the tempo is the most basic part of the game. If the tempo is off, you can bet the song is too. Get used to managing the tempo until it becomes second nature. Anyways, let's try practicing for real. Try moving the tempo control and get good at it. When the cue ball and cue point cover each other up, push the baton button and keep up the tempo. Whoopee! Way to go! Stand proud and keep on conducting like that! So which one shall we pick? Controlling the volume of the performance is as important as the tempo. The wrong volume will warp the emotion of the song. Put that in your conducting bag of tricks.
Anyways, let's try practicing for real. Get a feel for how hard to press down on the buttons and try working the volume control. Of course, the tempo needs to be in rhythm. If the tempo is out of whack, try using the buttons properly with the right strength. Shall we pick? To emphasize a specific sound, you need to give direction to the performer of that part. If you make a mistake here, the sound becomes strange. So be careful! Anyways, let's try practicing for real. Try getting good at using the directing control while talking with the band. When the arrow cue button appears while pushing the band button in the same direction, you can score the tempo with the baton button. Of course, don't forget to pump up the volume too. Which one shall we pick? I'll explain how the evaluation of your performance works during the game. Anyways, let's try practicing for real. Be aware of each musical bar and try to get a good or bravo rating. If you miss even one beat, the bar will be judged as bad, so pay attention. Thank you. 
Whoopee! Way to go! Stand proud and keep on conducting like that! So which one shall we pick? A meter called attention meter shows the quality of your performance. So, it's important to know how it works. Anyways, let's try practicing for real. I tried to prepare the ultimate situation for you. Start the performance in the devil mode and try to change into the angel mode by the end of the performance. So which one shall we pick? When the performance reaches a climax, a medley mode starts and the performance of another song begins. Let me explain. Anyways, let's try practicing for real. Don't overlook shifting into the medley mode. If you're successful, another song will start, but don't lose your cool. Thank you. 
So which one shall we pick? Stretching out the sound and adding individuality is the way to store up talent. It's important to add depth to the music and bring out your own individuality in your conducting. Good luck mastering the music! Anyways, let's try practicing for real. When the storage point appears, if you hold down the button, you can store up energy. When storing up things, try maxing out the volume button. So which one shall we pick? The way you push the buttons can change the sounds, creating stronger sounds. If you can express this difference in the song, your conducting will become even more wonderful. Anyways, let's try practicing for real. The point here is to work hard to push the buttons fast and strong instead of when the music is normally strong. So which one shall we pick? I'll tell you another way to play the game. But don't tell anyone else about it. It's a secret. Huh? Looks like fun, yeah? Try giving it a whirl if you have the chance. So which one shall we pick? That one's a big mystery. So which one shall we pick? 
You can view the room menu at any time during the tutorial. So come take a look sometime. Are you ready? Well then, let's do it! So which one shall we pick? Let's give it our all! This sure is a piece that everyone knows well. Actually, it's a folk song that's often sung while hiking. In fact, this song's so much fun you forget about being tired. So now, let's get practicing so you can perform it perfectly.
What a lovely song! It makes you want to dance in the sunlight on a summer day and feel the warmth throughout your body. I just love this song! I'm looking forward to your wonderful performance, so let's get practicing!
a piano piece, but with an exciting melody from some far-off land. Once you hear the flowing beauty of this melody, you'll never forget it. I think you'll probably remember hearing this before, too. That's because it's a memorable masterpiece. Time for your solo practice. I have high hopes for you.
gentle melody starts softly as if it were meant to be heard from a distance. A singing voice can be heard from a high place. A place where angels soar in the blue sky. Rehearse until the rush of your performance can climb into the clear blue skies.
The concert pages have been restored. Let's conduct a great concert and restore the power of the book. Maybe you'll be bewildered the first time, but the rules for concerts are different from those of rehearsals. I mean, after all, you'll be performing with the audience right in front of you. The audience judges whether or not it was a success or failure. There is no audience tension meter, so pay attention to the audience's reaction during the performance. A concert is a success when all the pieces are performed, the audience is made to feel happy, and you are engulfed by a wave of applause from the audience. When the performance is not going well, people from the audience will leave halfway through the show. If the concert ends like that, it's a failure. But don't sweat it. You'll do fine. You'll have several chances to get it right. Then, if the program's a success, you'll be asked for an encore. Direct the climax of the concert with the ultimate in performances. You'll do fine. You can do it. How do you do? My name is Hannibal. The town that you live in is a town overflowing with music. Music is always played somewhere, and the town itself has thrived on music. Rumors, little whispers in the night, brought me here. And this is where I came across that book. I conducted a concert on a street corner based on the score written in the book. The alon of music that arose from the hearts of the townspeople filled the legendary opuses. At that glorious moment, newly born Symphony was bestowed with her beautiful voice. And this is how the loving memory of her music won the hearts and minds of many. I'd like for you to hold a revival concert here and uh, flood the town with music yet again. The baton is in your hands, Takt. I'm counting on you. The concert took place on a street corner along the river. It is written here in the book, but... I wonder just where in Bravo Town was it? Anyways, the legendary opuses will show us the way there. Do you feel the moment? Let's break a leg!